Hi, once again, it's me, Charles French with Total Image Menswear, and welcome to another edition of Style Etiquette. In today's edition, I'm going to try and teach you how to tie the bow tie. The bow tie is really coming back, so pay attention. I'm going to try and do it slow. So here we go. With your bow tie hanging even on each side, I want you to begin to tie it like you tie your shoe. All right, boys, it's another fit in the can. What's next for us? Now take this top portion here. Uh, and throw it over your shoulder. How about a board game now or something? Now take this bottom portion and form a bow. Now no. take this top portion. No, I think we should stick to videos. People really seem to love those. Hold on, I think Jamie's on to something. You can see I think we need to do something new. Something we haven't tried before. Your bow. Like what? Put them together. How about a talking dog? Because <laughs> now we're back to the form of the I like it. Now take the bottom yeah, I like that a lot. What if it were a talking cat? Hold up, what? Do you think that's funny? We put a cat in a suit, and then uh, we can name him Mr. Meow, and he could talk uh, like this. Uh, How about some tuna? Okay, okay. The talking dog's name is Mr. Meow. Oh, I like that. No, no, cats are overrated and dirty, and I don't want any semblance of them in our work. Okay, well, now the, uh, the talking dog doesn't have a name. What are you going to do with a talking dog? You're going to parade it around town without a name. Jesus Christ, Mike, think! Hold on. Jesus Christ. Great idea. We remake Passion of the Christ, but we replace the people with talking dogs. No. No more religious stuff. I'm tired of getting letters. Die Hard with talking dogs. Now Die Hard 2. Die Hard. This dog is going to play Samuel Jackson, though. Well, Samuel Jackson was in Die Hard with a Vengeance. And if anyone's going to play him, I think it should be my cat. Just forget about the cat. Charlie? No, no, listen, Mike. I'm tired of your stupid cat rules, okay? <laughs> What's wrong with Mr. Meow? Okay, I'm fine with the cats, but you have to stop with the stupid voice. Everybody loves Mr. Meow and his fabulous voice. We should just do another green screen. Those are easy. We can't be doing the same things over and over again. We're supposed to be heading in a new direction. Okay? Why not? They've worked for us because in the past. You just do the same thing over and over again. Two green screen, 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 screen videos. It's all we have. They weren't. Okay, and I can I can add it up. No, I really almost agree with you because you don't seem to. You get so confused because they saw you. They wanted to say you failed. They thought you were William Ray. And guess what? Cowardly sucks. So. Then the shopkeeper says, That's no dog. That's our Lord and Savior. Why does everything have to be about God? Go, 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 go. Why do I care about the shopkeep? What makes him relatable? <sighs> um, I don't know. I guess I could write in that he has like a bunch of kids or something. Better make it six. You, uh, you should have said five. Oops, Robo Girl! No! <laughs> what balls on me? <laughs> That's you. Okay, all I'm saying is, uh, Dennis Hopper, Blue Velvet, Mario Brothers movie. Same character. Think about it. Damn, man. A father is a mystery. And the reason is you. Do it. Come on. Come on, do you it. I think I will? Do it. I'll do it. I'll do it. Do it. Do it. Every dog has his day? Yeah, that could work. Yeah, fine. Let's put it in. Well, we finally did it. The perfect script. Well, let's go shoot it then. Go get Nick. Good job. Yeah, good. I mean, good job, yeah. Like I'm excited to see where this is going to move. Come on. Yeah, come on. Yeah.
You ready to go? Yep. Hello, shopkeep. Yes, that's me. I use the funds from the shop to feed my seven children. That's great. I'm looking to buy a dog. A dog? Hmm, well, I've got one more left. Let me go get her. Okay. Here she is. Hey, little guy, what's your name? Mr. Meow. A talking dog? That's amazing. You should see me chase my tail. I'll warn you, though. This dog has some of the foulest farts I've ever smelled. Really? That's too bad. I'd buy him, but I hate the smell of farts. Where am I? What's going on? Ah! Oh. Oh. oh, that stench! Wow! Wait a minute. I can see. This dog's farts has cured my blindness. That's no dog. That's our Lord and Savior. Every dog has its day. We're back, bitch.